Okay. So that was good. That was drama free. We were great. She's impossibly in drama with too nice. But we do have some drama. But we're not. Around. Yeah, that's what I was about There's to say. A lot we of don't drama. have to be safe. So the Sway House Clima. I'm in a fight right now, which to me is one of the more preposterous fights I've found myself in with Jackson right. Mahomes. <laughs> no, I'm actually in a little fight with him too, I think. Yeah, I think you may be too. And here's where it's strange. So let me set the stage. There's a bunch of things that happened. First of all, this week, Jackson Mahomes started basically TikTok. I don't know what you say. Tweet, Instagram at, t- TikToking at Nessa, right? Yeah. He was like. Duetting. I guess duetting her. It was like some songs, you know, with like the words and the songs. Listen to the words, right? Like talking about like give her this dick if she lucky and shit like that. So. Anyways, um, we have little. this stuff to show. Let's show what it is. Let's show now. It, let's show what it is. I like you. I don't give a fuck about your boyfriend. Come on, let's link. Can't do what I do. I can beat it up with no hit. Well, that's just him singing. What's that have to do with Nessa? The lyrics are about Josh. Yeah, so that was that was right after I think some of the drama happened. So people like associated it together, and then he made a duet to a video Nessa made. Remember we talked about it on the podcast where it was like, I wonder if I'm lucky because Ness like was videoing herself and then it was like a stitch with me talking about like hooking up or whatever. So he duetted that video with Ness where she's singing that song and pretty much like was saying he wants to like dick her down or whatever. And then I duetted it with the, you know, stitch and like looking back and Ness was in my bed. So that's kind of like where it all started. Right, and, and, and then he said, I don't know how we don't have this stuff ready to go, but he's, here's the video here. Looking at me, I know you want to fuck me. I'll give you this dick if you're lucky. Been a few days, I just want me some cake. I tell her, come on, bring a bag. So when did he do that? That was about, what, four or five days ago now, maybe? But, but what provoked it? What led to that? He he just did it. Did that, that out was like the cloud. Okay. Random yeah. makes that duet with Nessa. Then you go back and forth and, and she's laying in bed. I saw he's like, she looks, bo- uh, she looks bored, right? Yeah. He said that. Yeah, he did. And what was your response? <clears throat> you, 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 you're, so I said long night, probably tired. So this is all out of the clouds. Him just, has Nessa ever talked to him? No. Okay. So random. So random of him. No. Yeah. Like, a very, very weird, random thing. And it was like, I didn't want to have to bury Jackson Mahomes, but I did. Like, I didn't want to, but I He was posting with his girlfriend a few weeks ago, though. So I thought he was in his own relationship. What did Nessa say about any of this? I I think she just laughed at him, if I'm not mistaken. It was kind of like one of those. Okay. So uh, that happens. We got to get Nessa back on here, by the way. I'm a Nessa stand too. But that, so that happens. Now, while this is going on, I actually thought I was like friendly with Jackson Mahomes because, right. like, all right, three years ago or whatever it is, Jackson Mahomes and I believe it is um, Patrick Mahomes' girlfriend, I believe at the time, they made this video at the Patriots game. I'm a huge Patriot fan for anybody who doesn't know. And they're like dancing and making a scene after beating the Patriots, who at the time were the defending Super Bowl champs in Foxborough. So I'm like, all of New England were fucking mad at these two people. And I wrote, yeah. uh, I wrote a blog. I'm like, these two fucking assholes. Basically, come beat us. Do that dance when you beat us in the playoffs. It's kind of like a football. And by the way, I stand by if you're Jackson Mahomes and you're the brother of like the best quarterback in the league and you're going to go TikTok and dance and brag after you beat other teams, other teams fans are going to hate you. That's that's hundred percent part of the game. You have to know yep. that. Well, Jackson Mahomes and then I had like a back and forth not too long ago where we were in a dance off. Like he did a right. dance, tagged me getting off a plane I did a dance in Miami, and I thought, okay, we're having fun with it. It's like a joke. This thing happens where he he talks about NASA, so we reach out. Hey, come on the pod. And I still think it's friendly. I thought it was going to be like, yeah, absolutely. I'll be on the pod. Well, he doesn't respond to, like, Kareem, who does our social, and Paul. And I'm like, do we have him? No. So it's like, all right, I'll reach out because I think I'm friendly with him. So I'm like, hey, right. come on our podcast. He writes back screen capture of 
the blog I wrote years ago being like, these two assholes, you're like, you've disrespected my family. You've disrespected like everything I'm about. I think I'll pass. I was stunned. I'm like, wait a minute. And I wrote back to him like, are you not self-aware? Like, is everything <laughs> you do serious? Because I thought yeah. you were in on the joke. And then I post it. He's like, well, why don't you post the whole conversation? I don't even know what that meant. I posted everything. I didn't even know what Kareem and Paul had sent. But where my mind is right now, I think the dance-off I got with him in Miami was serious. It was. No, I think he, I think he actually was trying to dance against you. Yes. I was in a real, like, Jets and Sharks, West Side Story dance-off. No, yeah. That's didn't incredible. Even that's the best part is that you had no idea you were even in this legendary dance. Song. He like so after the- he's like, I smoked you, bro. He was serious. 100% <laughs> serious. That's like one of the more amazing things that's happened to me since I've started. <laughs> like I was in what I thought was a Zoolander style dance off. And the other guy was basing like his existence on winning that dance off. Wow. Yeah. No, I mean. It's weird that he targeted you on a dance off and then me right after. It's like he's coming for the BFFs like squad here. Brianna, did, watch out. Did you know no. that? Did, am I the one that I thought we were like? I thought for sure he was coming on. I thought I was friends with him. I've never been more like caught off guard when he's like, "No." I was like, "Wait, what do you mean, no?" I I, I thought it was like jokes he's, more. He's right? Very like serious. it seemed like he was. Well, it seemed like he was doing it. It seemed like he was aware enough that he was doing it all for, like, numbers, obviously, right? Like, yeah. that's what it kind of came off as. Like, okay, this guy obviously knows he's being kind of whack. So he's, he's probably just like doing you. this for the fun. But he's serious. Yeah, no. like, he, you can make fun of yourself. We watch your old videos. He's 100% serious in all of his videos. So, did I? all right, that's where I didn't know that. And I didn't. I, I I'm beginning that. to think I've lost touch with, I guess, reality enough where, like, wait a minute. I'm so far off on this. Am I the crazy one? Like, I think how- he wants to be Josh. Like, he wants to be a TikTok phenomenon. He's the worst dancer of all time. <laughs> he's the worst. He, he's awful. I know. And I'm not, like, saying I'm Fred Astaire. Like, but I knew when I did my dance. I'm like, oh, I look like a total asshole. That's why it works. He, I think, thinks this is real. He thinks we've it's left- like dancing on the stars or something. Yes. Yeah. We've left Earth. Mm. And by the way, he's also left Earth. If you think you can go in the NFL or sports, which fans hate each other, you can go do these dances in the and other people's absolutely- stadium. Right. Roasted. It's like taking your flag and sticking on the logo. Obviously, the other fans are going to be like, you assholes. It's like it's like what Juju did, right? Like him with exactly. the TikTok dancing all over the fields. But the thing about Juju is he's actually an NFL player. Correct. So it's like he's actually made it and is a – like you can't argue he's better than everyone that's making fun of him that's a fan. He's the one in the NFL. Jackson, it's like, well, you're not really in it. Your brother's in it. He's great, <laughs> your brother. But it's like – Fans are going to fucking despise you despise. if you're going to start shitting on their teams and you're not even a player. And your dances stink. I mean, they stink. I mean, if we're going <laughs> to call it like it is, Jackson Mahomes cannot dance. He cannot yeah. dance. If that's how we're no. going to play it, if we're going to have to go to the literal police, if Jackson Mahomes went on Dancing with the Stars, he got a 0.0 and get laughed out of the building by that like French guy, British guy. He'd be like, 100. yeah. Get out of my show. I don't want you here. Off. Brianna, did you know he was serious the whole time? You sound like you knew that. I've been looking at his TikToks for a while. We send them in the group chat. It's funny because he's very serious about all of them. So I've been like, I've been watching them for a little bit. So when he's talking to <laughs> Nessa, he's serious? Yes, he wants Nessa, I think. But also for likes. It's for likes and views. Yeah, it's definitely like a little, little clout farm in action. But I think he thinks he's the man when he does it. Even though so he thinks he's cool. Stupid. Yeah, because his brother's who his brother is. Yeah, but his, yeah. his brother he's is li- his brother. Yeah, he's living off the brother's 
clout, I would say. That is fucking crazy.